Well, hello everyone. My name's John, and this is my second video on my newly created channel, Small Spaces, Big Places. And I have to start by saying, wow, I can't believe the subscribers already. Uh, <laughs> it started with about, uh, I think I got up to maybe 10-ish on the second day, and here we are a week later, and I've doubled that easy. So uh, I'm very touched by that, and thank you. That's just the kind of encouragement and uh, support that I needed uh, was looking for to just kind of give me that little extra boost to uh, to press forward here and keep keep you know keep doing these these videos uh, and all of that so I know you guys have obviously a lot of interest uh, even before that just with the emails which thank you for those as well by the way uh, but through the emails you know as well uh, that you have a lot of interest in what I'm doing specific specifically the work and I, I understand that and I am going to focus on the work uh, but I hope to as 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 uh, down the road here to uh, let you know a little bit about me and uh, so you kind of get to know me a little bit a little bit better I know that's important as well and uh, and Lucy as well because a lot of you showed a lot of support for Lucy uh, I mean after all she's 18 years old so she has uh, quite a history as well uh, so I'm hoping to do that and, and let you see more of her and and all that so you know she's doing uh, doing okay or how she's doing uh, and yeah but for now I'm just gonna focus on the job because uh, of course that's where the, the strong interest is in. Uh, so the way I'm, I decided what I'm going to do is, uh, and, and a little bit from suggestions I got, was to an, uh, do uh, kind of answer some questions here uh, for sort of my first video. Uh, so I'm going to do that uh, in more of just the more, a few of the common questions I got. But uh, what I decided was a lot of the questions are going to require a little more in depth. And I did want to make one video with all of that because it would just be too long so it's just me in front of the camera and it's nice to know you guys like to watch me that's great but I do want to keep these videos 10 minutes or less uh, preferably you know even f eight, five to eight minutes if I can pull it off this video is gonna be a little longer because I'm doing a little more of an intro here but uh, uh, yeah, but the future videos I hope to keep them 10 minutes or less. But anyway, I'm gonna do a video on uh, vehicle options um, As far as when you're out trying to figure out which kind of vehicle to get you don't have to get the vehicle I got to get into the business and in some cases that may be your only option uh, is to get a uh, especially uh, one that costs less um, So I'm gonna do that and I'm also gonna tell you why I picked my vehicle and I'll tell you more about my vehicle I had some questions about miles per gallon and, and maintenance costs and those kinds of things so I'll get into that in a video uh, the other video I want to make which is probably my guess is going to be the most popular one is going to be income and expenses um, it's not going to be a super in-depth because uh, there's still I, I you know this business goes up and down so that it's I haven't really been able to come up with sort of an average yet uh, but I, I've I'll, I'll tell you what I know and, and hopefully it'll be enough and, and help you out uh, so I'll do a video on that I'm also going to do a video on uh, companies uh, specifically the brand name companies the big guys because uh, that's what I was originally looking to go work for uh, so uh, I'll just kind of you know share what I know or what I found out uh, obviously I at the last minute I met a, another expediter who referred me to a smaller company I talked with them and felt that I would go that direction so that's what I did um, so I'm gonna do a video on that and then uh, I'm also going to do an action video, probably be my first one, uh, where I show the unloading and loading. I had some questions about that, and I'll try to give you a few tips as well. So when you do get out to doing it, the, hopefully that'll help. It's just what, what I got from other expediters uh, when I started out, so I'll share that with you. Um, so that's kind of what I have planned for, for the videos, but for right now, I'm just going to go ahead and answer some of the um, uh, common questions I got um, in general so here we go uh, first one was uh, do I need a special license to do this um, uh, this work and the answer is no you do not need a special license um, a commercial license even though you're driving a commercial vehicle and you're uh, you know doing commercial work so yeah but you just a standard license that's all you need uh, now the companies possibly that out there there's some companies that may require a commercial license for some reason um, I could imagine what that would be uh, to just you know a lot of it's going to be certainly the size of the vehicle uh, so you know there are comp uh, expedite companies that uh, that uh, you know 
have larger there's even ones that have tractor trailers so obviously you would definitely need one so it's really good but i'm just talking about like vans in general uh or what they call box trucks um uh, any, uh, you know, smaller box trucks, that is, uh, you, yeah, you're not going to need a, a special license. Um, but again, I'm going to get into that detail in another, another video. So, all right. So no special license. Uh, you might need a medical card. That is possible. I, I ran into a few companies as I was out there that, uh, require a medical card. So you may need to get that. Um, again, I'm not going to go into detail right now on that, but I will tell you that it's, you know, it's about a hundred ish dollars to get, and you just have to go to a, uh, certified uh, physician, which you can find online. They have a registry, a dot physical registry list. And, uh, and then you'll, they'll give you the card right on the same day as your appointment. So assuming you pass everything. Uh, so yeah, so keep that in mind, but that's, still pretty rare in fact that's why this job is really popular is because it doesn't really require anything special what it does require is kind of special i guess or special is uh the insurance so commercial insurance uh you will need to have and you can get that directly and the go-to company pretty much the only one out there is progressive so you can go to progressive and you can even go now and just get a quote from them uh and then a lot of the companies do offer uh you to have insurance through them and of course if you do that then uh, you'll get what's called a group rate so obviously that'll mean you hopefully will be paying less um so you can go that route some require you to go that route as well uh and then some like say give you the option uh to go that that route so uh yeah so just keep that in mind about insurance so next thing is the uh uh, loading and unloading. Um, <clears throat> some were asking, well, do I have to unload and lo uh, load it and unload it? And the answer is no. Uh, there's a forklift uh, that'll put put it in your van, take it out of your van. Uh, what you do have to do is strap it down. And that's pretty easy to do. And again, I hope to show you a video at some point about on how, how that goes. But really, you're looking at about, I've averaged about 20 minutes, you know, somewhere in there, give or take. Um, and during you know for at the shipper and the receiver uh so maybe like an hour total uh the rest of the time i'm you know just driving uh which is what i enjoy doing and you know it's the other part of my life out here and living out on the road so that's why i liked it because it only it took up very minimal time and it physically it wasn't very hard to do and yeah so and i'm sure some of you have picked up on that a little bit uh so yeah so anyway that's uh uh pretty much the questions i wanted to cover on this video uh in that so i know it wasn't a lot but i you know i just kind of wanted to more set it up for these other videos which will be uh more in depth so I'll be looking forward to, uh, to those, hopefully. And uh, and I think what I'd like to do is just sort of end uh, with a shot of uh, Lucy. She's over here sleeping. She's usually always sleeping. So if I don't see her up and holding her too often, that's why. But I will give you a little shot of her for you dog lovers out there. Um, let me see. I'm sorry. I'm using my iPad, by the way. So there she is. See? She just out. She loves sleeping. <laughs> she just ate too, so uh, which after she eats, she she gets pretty tired. So, so sorry for the shakiness there. Uh, I was using my computer before, but I can't charge it uh, right now, so I'll, I'm going to be using my iPad. So I hope the picture's quality it looks good on my end here, and I hope the audio is okay. I'm trying to stay fairly close to uh, to the mic. So, uh, but that's all I got for you guys. So thank you for watching uh, and hanging in there with me. And I'll get uh, get to those other videos as soon as I can. Um, and uh, yeah, and we'll just we'll just keep going forward as long as there's some interest. Uh, you know, more than happy to uh, keep this up. All right, take care, everybody. Bye-bye now.